Hi Michael, Phil B there from the Wilderness Club. Quick recap on our lesson today. So this is driver. We can see here as you take the club away, one, these hands are separating from the body. We can see that first move's going away. And what that's doing is that's getting the club head low and inside. And we can see at this stage here, one, the club's fanning open. Two, it's, it's too far behind you. If we look at Charlie Howe here as he takes the club away, one, we're going to see his hands are going to move inwards but that club head is going to stay outside the line. So you can see at that same stage there, very different. Hands have gone in, club head out. He's got the face of the club face still at 45 degrees compared to yours has moved open. Because yours has moved open, when you get to the top, we're going to see here that club face now at the top of the swing is completely shut. Where if we look at Charlie's, we're going to see his, shut, his club face is more at 45 degrees uh, or closer to it than yours and where yours is so shut the only way you can now keep this ball on line is to spin on the way through which we're going to see here your legs are going to start clearing probably too quickly we can see that now that left knee's disappeared far too early and you've got to spin fast and to hit almost a push cut or a block cut uh, as opposed to the shot we would actually like and if you don't turn quick that club's going to outrace you with a shut face then you're going to hit it over here a little low pulley left one so that's that's the miss we had one thing we did you didn't realize is that if we're trying to hit the ball on this yellow line we don't want it to start left and cut back to it okay so if we want it if we want to hit the ball on this yellow line we're going to start it left of it obviously but it's going to fade on to it i don't know if that makes any sense at all but what you were tending to do is you was tending to still aim straight at the target okay and then expecting the ball now to start left and slide back, where well you now realise your shot is a push cut. So you're, you're, you, if this was the target, you need to be aiming at this second yellow post and allowing the ball to now push to the middle of them posts and then drift onto it. So push cuts, look up like Rose, Norren, Kepka, DJ, all hit push cuts. So your feeling really is steep to shallow and then release down the right-hand side Definitely with the driver and the two iron, you could do with a little bit of closure of the club face. It was just tending to hang open too much. The irons, it was very good. But if the boys slide in too much left to right, two things to check. One, the face, and two, that your hands aren't going left too quickly through the hitting zone. So steep to shallow on the way down, through impact, feel like your arms are going more this way out to the right. And if the ball's cutting too much, release the club face, and uh, we'll be in business. If we look at Charlie here, Drops the club beautifully inside. Great hand path. And now watch his hands go out to the right there. Club head still down the right hand side as well compared to yours on the way through. Your handle really wants to go left very quickly. So work on that for me, Brownie, and you'll get some great results. Cheers, bud.